newly surfaced Hunter Biden email show his business contacts bragging about Hunter's access to his father as well as to China. Here to react, Fox News contributor Lara Trump. Okay, so we're dealing with some more emails having to do with Hunter. And these say that Hunter Biden requested a two million dollar retainer to help get um, Libyan assets that were frozen by uh, former President Obama. And then a part of the email says that Hunter um, has access to the highest levels in the People's Republic of China and he can help there. What's your reaction to that? Well, good morning, guys. Um, well, we knew this was happening, right? We knew this was happening last year when the Hunter Biden laptop story surfaced. Unfortunately, there were countless Americans who never really heard about it because these stories were all suppressed. They were censored by big tech. Um, almost every media outlet in the mainstream media did not report on this, oh, until well after the election. Um, this is really, really scary stuff. Have you ever had any question about where things stood as far as Hunter Biden is concerned? We get more answers every day. He is a liability, not just to his father, but to the United States of America. And at, at, on a personal level, I think what is mo most frustrating about all of this is that when my father-in-law was president, we all knew that as part of the first family, we were a direct reflection uh, on every single American. And we took that very seriously. We went above and beyond to make sure there wasn't even the faintest hint of impropriety. We, don't forget, had a company who had overseas business dealings legitimately. Yet right. when my father-in-law was in office, we said no new business deals at all. Yet you see how we were all attacked. The fact that this is what Hunter Biden has been doing and continues to do and and Joe Biden has been lying about it is incredibly scary for America. But Lara, to that end, where would the media coverage be, let's say, if your husband Eric had sent an email like that? <laughs> Oh, Todd, I can't even imagine uh, it would be through the roof. They would have called for yet another impeachment of my father-in-law, of course, if something like that had happened. But there is such a double standard, and I think people are starting to catch on to it now in America. Um, it is a shame that we have sunk to this low of a level that you have to find out a year later that stories are actually true. I guarantee you when we saw the polls after the, the election in 2020 that so many people said, you know, if I knew about this story with Hunter Biden's laptop, I wouldn't have voted for Joe Biden. And with good reason, there is influence on this White House without question, according to these emails um, from China and from many, many other countries around the world, thanks to Hunter Biden. Yeah, well, let's take Hunter out of this for a second. What does this mean for President Biden? I mean, I guess his defense would be, I, I never knew what my son was doing. I, I never had any 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 uh, you know anything having to do with his business dealings yeah well i think we all know that that is not true 10 percent for the big guy we now confirm the big guy is joe biden um why was he being paid i i think it is ridiculous to think that joe biden did not know what his son hunter was doing it seems like at every turn yeah. he was trying to bail him out whether it's with prostitutes whether it's with drugs uh, on all different fronts so we're going to assume somehow that he didn't know when right. millions right. of dollars were being offered what he Lara, was doing right. we Give gotta me go a break